Good stuff. Okay, guys, we're moving on. Are you guys ready? Second room. Transposition. Transposition ciphers aim to disguise a message by changing the positions of its letters. The word transposition alone is over 6 billion possible rearrangements, so it's capable of offering very strong encryption. However, the time it takes to encipher and then decipher a message, as well as the length of the key which must be exchanged, are important factors when deciding on a cipher to use. For this reason, most transposition ciphers will use a simple pattern of encipherment, such as reading off every other letter in a plain text to create a cipher text. When crypt analyzing a text, you should begin working through possible numerical patterns, starting from the simplest. You won't need to decipher the whole text using your text test pattern as valid distributed letter pairing should soon indicate if it reveals an English word. Attempting to find a pattern which links together common pairs of letters like TH as well as a good eye for anagrams can help speed up decryption. Now we're anagramming. What's the what's the things we have? Most common English diagrams. Okay. Is that even a word? Oh God. Okay. Well, that's not it. Those three E's at the beginning need to be of some... Man, I gotta get out. I gotta get my brain out of... I gotta get out of bacon brain. I'm in bacon brain right now, ladies and gentlemen. Very, very thick bacon brain. No hidden... No hidden, hidden shenanigans, right? So it's starting on the first and skipping, skipping, skipping. And then am I supposed to number those and then put them back in? Or is that overthinking it? it looks like the bottom line of letters. Oh. Wait, no, that doesn't help me. Because it goes, oh, the other. Okay, so we go, other, other, space out. So then we would go. Okay. Ah! Best part of the song. Once again, everybody enjoy it. Love this note. Jewels are hidden beneath the so that is the there we go. Got it. Got it. Woo! The jewels are hidden be between the, the elm tree. Got it. So if you take that first section, put a space, put a space in between each one. Take the second one, jam it in there. All right, let's go on to number three.
Okay. Well done. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Here we go, let's get crazy with it. We've got a... Uh, We've got toe, toe in the middle over there. Are the X's trying to give us a sign? Are the X's trying to tell us? Top to bottom between them. Between the two bottom X's are or. Between those X's are A R O N E T D A I T D A I. No, that doesn't spell a word. Is this a word search or is this a... I do see Thor. Yep, there's Thor over on the right side there. Anytime there's two connected. What there's... Anytime there's two connected, you're supposed to use that. S-E-X. That spells sex. We're good so far. Another X. More sex. Note is an anagram down there in the middle. We have two H's next to each other. What are all the letters... Do we have next to each other? We have, uh, we got, we got T's next to each other. We got an E. Just like every other. We have, oh, geez. I don't think that's gonna help us. But I think I have a pretty good idea of something to try for this. I think I got a pretty good idea. Let's see if, uh, let's see if it's successful and then I can go through, go through an explanation here. Oh, well, my plan just got pooped on. Okay, let's try it the other way. Oh, this might this actually might be better. What? Maybe not. Nope, I suck. So we are trying to assess what is what is the message here? What is the what is the answer to this code that we are seeing in front of us? What does that look like? Oh. Bax, talk out loud what you're seeing. Okay. Auto got it. Nice. Well done. Okay, so what I'm seeing is I'm seeing uh I'm seeing seven columns and seven rows. I'm thinking that there is in here maybe like one letter per row or column to spell out a word. I'm seeing a lot of doubles. I'm seeing two E's in one column here, two X's. Uh, I'm seeing two U's, two S's, two S's, two E's, uh, two H's. That seems to be some kind of a consistent pattern in some way, shape, or form that is, that is meaning something. Um, I'm trying to boggle this thing so I can boggle it and do like rot, rote, rotes, ass, jargon, scent whatever like we can we can boggle it up right we can do all all the boggle we want that's not really getting us anywhere um so what would be the thing that this is trying to tell us oh boy um if we're numbering things i can look at values of numbers i can look what's contained i can look what's included diagonals there's diagonals that are touching there's a bunch of x's there there's there's o's that are touching diagonally e's touching diagonally i gotta think that that means something Perhaps if we take all the doubled up, no, because I already did that. I already wrote down all the doubled up ones, and that just needs to be big mishmashing, mission mashing. I see toe spelled out. See, there we go, Fars. I'm, I'm, I'm right where you are, man. I see that toe, you know? I'm not sure what I should be seeing, but I feel like I should be seeing the thing. Everybody else is seeing the thing, and I just want to see it too. <laughs> okay, so ass. I gotta get my head out of tra out of a uh, stenography or stenography, stena sten sten whatever stenography, stega steganography, steganography, whatever, Pfft. whatever it was. Okay, ass is a thing. I see another ass above that, the ass there on the left. Okay, so we have ass, ass, sass. Sassinino? There's X's up there. They look important. There's an ass in the bottom left. That seems to be something I'm supposed to see and work with. Well, I see ass in the bottom left. Then I see an ass that's up like a block to the left. 
Um, I mean, I can do ass all over the place. We can, we can, we can ass in all these different blocks down here. There is an S up in the top left as well, so we can do A S, and then go to that S up there if we want to get really crazy with it. I see Jade. I also see Jade. But that's just a diagonal word. What means that's the solution? I don't understand. What would mean that's the solution? Farzam sees a thing. He sees the word jade. I see toe. I see saints. I see tent. I see neat. I see what the, I see. I see. I see. I see soot. I see whore. I don't understand what that like. I see a bunch of words. Why is that word important? I see the word the next to jade. Oh my god. <laughs> okay well i see the end of it now so let's try to work backwards then okay so we got we got shanunu and shanene we knew new and then you got And then from there, we actually pop up. So we go here. So we got... Okay, okay, we're nuts. Here we go. Thing. And then we got... Oh, and we got... Uh, okay. Uh. Oh, 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 the words, I see words. Yo, this is nuts. Oh, yes. Jeez, I can't believe I was just sitting there like an idiot saying ass over and over. Ass, I see ass. Ass, it's ass. Okay, so assassin and route. Trust no one. Hide the jade dragon. Guys, here's your next one. Yeah, the Q, the Q seems pretty obvious. Uh, so what I'm seeing here is we have Q, three letters, Q, three letters, Q, three letters, Q, three letters. Now, what does that mean? I don't know. It means something, I'll tell you that much. It means something. Okay. I don't know what it means. Huh. But I know it means something. Four Qs. Yep, RTS, RTS, E-K-I-D-T-A-N-W-A. N-W-A! Um, I see kid. Oh my god, I think I got it. No, I didn't. Um, let's see. If we were to have... So if we take away the cues, we have warts, kid, tan... The E doesn't seem to fit into that, though. Like, warts can wrap around. W-A-R-T-S. Um, Q's gone. Then we have... Uh, I don't know what the E's for. Kid is in there. Tan is in there. We just don't know what the Q's for. Nice job getting it so quick, Scal. Good work, man. Yes, no. Quesadilla? Perfect. Got it. Quesadilla confirmed. Nice job, dude. Oh. You know, so far the hints haven't, like, uh, they haven't pooped me out. What? Okay, this isn't working. 
What I thought was supposed to be happening is not happening. I see straw. I see straw on the other side. I see raw. Oh. I see. Tr I saw. I already saw trike. Guys, guys, listen, listen. The answer is Strick Eat Dawn. Strick Eat Dawn. How did I not see Strick Eat Dawn? And the race is on. Oh, screw this, man. Most accomplished Ingress, Inger, Inger, <laughs> Ingress. <laughs> uh, I need to write these down real quick. T H I N E R. So looking for these. Looking for. Okay, so we have T H I N E R R E A N H E. These are the. These are the most used. These are the most used things here. Okay. Okay, so let's get some basic data here. What do we got? I mean, clearly we have all the constants over in like the middle left. Those have to be split up. We have a, we have all the vowels over in the in the far left here. Those all have to be split up. They all go at the end of all these other letters. So it's almost like we have to somehow we have to lift all this up and just like it's like shuffling. We have to shuffle them together, right? Two groups, two cards. We split our deck and then we shuffle it together, and it's gonna spell something. But we don't know. We don't know what's the rule. What's the rule for that split? What's the rule for that shuffle that we have to do? I didn't give myself enough room. Jeez, I'm terrible. Here we go. New paper. Boom. <laughs> Got it, baby. Oh wait, 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 did I spell it wrong? Wait, I spelled it wrong. I just spelled it wrong. Okay. Oh God. The, why is it that the simpler it is, the more terrified I am? Wait, wait. How, how would we get to the point where we can take away Queen? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Yeah! But I have to figure out the right order. I figured it out, but I don't know the order. Hold on. Let's figure out the order real quick. An E for castle. Okay, we're doing this tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning at 10 a.m., okay? Same time, same place. And we will really dive into uh, some more of these cipherings and cryptology images. I. Whoops. I I have put in the answer. The answer the answer has been answered for our puzzle here, okay? So I'm not going to look at that. We're going to go back over to here, okay? The answer has been answered. We've been answered. All right? We came up with the answer. Mostly Hesser came up with the answer. And it 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 was disappointing. 
it was disappointing that it was correct so we think we accidentally stumbled across a shortcut that makes no sense best part of the song I said I would make you all angry. I said I would make you all angry because I don't know how that's the answer. That makes no sense. So here's what Hesera and I figured out. We figured out, oh, we stumbled on the answer without actually doing the work. <laughs> Just like with bacon, every advanced puzzle, what's supposed to be the hardest puzzle in the rooms, we are going to stumble across the answers without actually trying. How do we get there? Because we need to know. We need to know how this worked. And it was like the same thing as with bacon. It was the same thing. We're like, what? Like that, like it just, it just, it hurt our brains to be like, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, so go back to 30 letters. Okay, so we can start going back to 30 letters. Excellent, good. Ignore the blocks of four. Those spaces are red herrings. Ho ho ho. That's hot. So go back to 30. The things are red herrings. <clears throat> 30 letters, arrange them in a square. Arrange them in a square? What? What made you want to do that? That's ridiculous. Okay, we'll do five by six. We'll do five by six. Highly recommend six by five. What? What? We've got the same answer. By counting the amount of consonants. As the actual intended answer of transposition, which was to take these ignoring spaces put it into a six by five box to match up the z's creating text that reads down into an order of operations math problem that equals the same number When I tell Hisser, when I tell Hisser about this, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna freak. That is hilarious. We literally, he, I mean, we counted 30, 19 consonants, 11 vowels. And he's just like, okay, well, I'll try 11, I'll try 30, I'll try 19. And then there's like this silence. And I'm like, Hisser. He's like, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, that was the answer, wasn't it? <laughs> he's like, hey, Bex. I'm like, yeah. And he's like, I found the answer. <laughs> oh, my God.